All right, so out driving today with Tyler Uper. We are going to go drop off perks from the Indiegogo campaign from a year and a half ago for the film Nightfall. So we're going to drive around, and that's what we're going to be doing today. Mr. Reese, it seems you have a particular set of skills we can use. <laughs> Yes, it's on. It's recording. Right, here in another spot. Alright, another. Debit card? Yes, but tell them no. Tell them no? Yeah, and just enter our zip code. Okay. Oh, no, no. It wouldn't stop. Alright. That's I, fine. That's fine. I owe you a quarter. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so stopping at Taco Bell because my fat ass is hungry and I haven't eaten anything all day today. And I have been up for like five hours. So, have pity on me. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Here's a small little violin. Elf looks could kill. On to the next one. Oh, I'm the one doing this one? Yes! Why? Just, just go put it next to the, the door uh, at the bottom. On to the next. So we're in Baton Rouge, near LSU, sort of, and we stopped at racetrack because why, Tyler? I've got to piss. I gotta pee too. Pee pee in the pot, take pee pee in the pot. Take. Go, go, word, my 16 never returned. Pretty seen like a big fat turd. I've been set up, I'm not on turd. Criminal, that's what I heard. Took a thought, that's most absurd. No, I can expend it. All right, so we're here near LSU, which is the college I went to um, for my undergrad in sociology. And we're, and we're on our way to drop off our one of our um, Nightfall DVDs. But interesting little tidbit, we're coming up on the Louisiana School of the Deaf. That's, you know, people who can't hear. Um, and I used to deliver pizzas to the Louisiana School of the Deaf. Uh, and I got a little story for you. So the, the, story, the story is, is that Whenever you would go deliver a pizza to the river to the uh, school of death, you would open the door and go in, and like it would be like loud TVs playing in the uh, the background or static or something like that. You could you, there was no like like people talking because people use sign language. So when you walked into this building, there'd be no one around, but you could hear televisions or static or just loud music because some people could hear but only a little bit. And it was very creepy because you'd be going through these little hallways with fluorescent lights flickering and things like that and you, would, you wouldn't know where anybody was and you would come into a room where there's like six people like playing like pool or something but no one's talking. It was very creepy because it's just usually when you walk into a room like that, people would be talking or having conversation. And it was just one of those weird things where it's like everyone's silent and no one's talking. But there's a TV that's blaring or there's another TV that's got static on it. And it just it would just freak you out. The silence was definite. It was, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. <laughs> so I just want to point that out. So another one. Well, this one gets a bunch of other stuff. T-shirt, poster, and the DVD. Okay, don't. You're going to see my phone crack. Here we go.
right, so me and Tyler are here in Tigerland near LSU. I just kind of wanted to point out something. Over here is Domino's, the Domino's I worked at. That's actually where I made my short film pizza delivery. But anyway, I was coming from that direction in my car one night when I was delivering pizzas. And I came around this corner really fast and I slid the corner like, Grr! and then I countered. And when I countered, I turned sideways and jumped the curb and almost ran into that tree and killed myself. But I didn't, I'm here. And another one. It's the last one. Sort of. Sort of. Sort of. <laughs> now, we are officially at the last drop off. For realsies, For it's realsies. the last one. It's the last one. For realsies. Why am I saying what he just said? I don't know. And another one. Alright, so that's all the nightfall stuff that's been delivered, except for people who live out of the state. Those will have to be mailed to them. But other than that, we've delivered everything to the in-state people. And it took us six hours to go all around New Orleans to Baton Rouge and back. I think we should deliver the people out of state too, Carl. I'm game for that if you got the money for gas and food. No. Oh, well, I, don't I don't have that money. I have no problem driving to Georgia, uh, Indiana, then to Texas, and to California. Ooh, we could stop at LA. That's where the one in California is. It's right near there. But I don't got no money for that. No De Niro. Nope. No Bobby De Niro. This is just a little bit of a editing tip, Carl. Or not tip, but note. Don't put my bit in there. That was, that was just stupid.